Okay. So I'm talking about we have done for Colabora Online during the previous year. Um, this is the next one, yes. <clears throat> Maybe everybody must not know what Colabora Online is. Uh, it's the thing you basically get when you install the rich, rich documents Nextcloud app, which connects to Collabora Online. Um, it's fully open source and runs on, it, on, on its own server, or on the same, same server as, as Nextcloud, if you like. Uh, and Collabora Product Productivity is a company based in, in the UK, in Cambridge, but we have developers all over the world, almost. And um, by the way, we are hiring, so contact Michael when he comes here on Monday. <coughs> Our release schedule has been fairly um, consistent, like one major-ish release every two months or so. And uh, 3.4 is coming up soon-ish. I think maybe in a few weeks or so. <coughs> and the changes, like uh, about a year ago, included things for the admin console, where you see much more information about uh, who is using a document at the moment, who is, who is editing it, and it or viewing it. And we have added stuff like editing of charts. Uh, this all seems maybe fairly small details, but to many customers these are very important features that they expect from a, from a web-based office application. And find and replace in, in the spreadsheet. And spell checking and um, also WAP improvements. This is related to the actual file sharing functionality. <coughs> so we, we can now tell, or Collabora Online can now tell uh, Nextcloud whether a file was saved because it, it was uh, auto saved or by the user and so on. And uh, in Calc, we have added data filters also. That this is also something that, something that very many customers request. And cell formatting, cell border formatting is very important. Many people, people try to build up very complicated tables with all kinds of borders and uh, very few web-based office application actually support this. And again, these ch charts and data series. <coughs> and there are also, also charts in Writer. Uh, and in this case, we use the user interface inside the, the uh, rich documents application, so it looks a bit more native. and some other details. <coughs> and these are improvements specific for, for the next cloud integration. I think especially this web root thing, so web root things has been very, uh, very requested and it's now there in, in three dot something. And uh, also avatars are, have been added so that you can see the small picture of people who are editing the same file at the same time. And in the upcoming Collabora Online 3.4, we have done improvements on the speed. <coughs> we have reduced the number of, of uh, round trip network traffic for even trivial editing, like we used to have, if you add, add one, one character, it made two round trips and, and other improvements also. And my time is coming up, so 
I thank you and these are upcoming improvements. Okay, thank you.